whatever they want. And like he rolled a blunt and he got really high and like Sean, he didn't even play because he was just so <laughs> I think because he went over uh Valent Calvin Valentine his name. I forget his name. Shout out whoever that guy is. I don't know him. But he brought up his name, Valentine. I knew his name before that. Valentine. So Calvin, sweet. I believe. Ricker and Bond, everybody. It's both Ricker and Bond giving you the show entitled Ricker and Bond. If you're listening to this, you know how to get to our podcast, so you should rate it five stars wherever you have it. Subscribe as well. Go over there. <laughs> your favorite time of the week, I would guess. You know, just I, a, a fatty episode. Just I'm ready for you to just be engulfed in. Instagram. I'm, I might need to cut this. In. This, this is going to be real echoey. If I had some headphones in the bottom, maybe that would work. Um, I'm a little annoyed by it. Is I, I, <laughs> iPhone has to like have a mute feature, just a straight up just mute me, bro. Oh, that's uh, interesting. Or mute the the sound. I oh, try not. something now. As we, oh my God. that would be something to maybe slide in iOS 16, Tim, because he Man, codes everything okay. himself. I gotta get out. I gotta get out of here. Oh no! First of all, I lagged uh, it. I lagged it, dude. Uh, I lagged it. Oh, now we're now we're not in it anymore. But <laughs> hey, you're still listening. Yeah, that's, the thing. that's what we do, dude. Live stuff here on Ricker and Bond. Five stars. Record video with my iPhone 13. <laughs> you should do that. Right I had I had a stand, but I don't know where my stand is, and the angle isn't super flattering. Guys, um, quick update on the iPhone 13. It's sure. still bitching. Oh, cool. Yeah. A couple like, more weeks until it's, it's just normal? I, I don't know if it can ever get normal. It's just... It will. It will. It's just, you know, so good. I don't I don't understand it. I'm, like, using the front camera right now, and I'm like, whoa, this looks like a crystal clear image. Since when is the front camera, like, made you just be like, damn. I don't know. Uh, probably like not. Friends. Probably not in a long time. I saw a video of a guy at a baseball game with some, I think it was a Samsung phone, people said in the comments. Gross. He was, he was in the outfield, and he was just zooming in real deep on the, the person at the plate, which is a long distance. There is actually a Samsung phone with a really good camera, but at the end of the day, it's still a Samsung phone. <laughs> like, know. no, Samsung phones are good, but, like, they're software. Ugh, they're software. This makes me sad. You just like very box software. I just don't like to have like ah. four messaging apps and like eight maps apps and like 13 calendar apps, you know, like power to the people, power of choice, you know, the power of bloatware, power of used storage that could be used for other things. That is so you got cool. the fuck Samsung, you got Samsung messages, Verizon messages, uh, fucking, I don't know, like a bunch of things. I'm like, yo. Just give me some Samsung software. That's why I like the Pixel, because I was kind of like that. The last time I didn't have an iPhone was probably somewhere in middle school. Probably before that. Ooh, that must have been rough. I don't remember it. I think maybe my last one was the Razor, chocolate, chocolate Razor or something. The Flip. Well, in my opinion, the iPhone wasn't really like... No question about it, the better phone until like the iPhone 11, 10, 11. A couple years ago? Yeah, because like 7, 8, they were good, but like the Pixel was always just like a little yeah. bit better with the camera, you know, and Samsung would come up with the cool shit. Yeah, that one's just like, but now that phone's what, like five years old? You could buy that like refurbished for like 150 bucks and it's fine. Solid phone. Yeah, but at 13, ugh, nasty. You just scale it up, man. Apple phones after Apple phones after Apple phones. They were like, we don't give a fuck anymore about the camera bump. We're just going to make it as big as possible. Just literally just, it's just going to tilt on your thing like that. Oh, is that what it does? It, it's such such a big tilt, but mm. the glory of it is everybody knows it's a 13 because it won't sit flat. Unless ah. you have a case on it, which most people do, but I don't, mm. so. You know, that's, that's a sign of risky behavior that some people like, you know, living on the edge. I'm insurance. Oh. I think it's 20, 29 bucks for a new screen. 
<laughs> Way to ruin the risky mystique. Oh, yeah. If I didn't have insurance, for sure, I would fucking have a case. What, what is that? A year? Two years. Insurance is a racket, dude. Theft and loss. Too. I, it's, it's expensive, but like the peace of mind, like you just can't beat it. <laughs> like, honestly, because I don't want to be worrying about my phone, the thing I use every day. I know, I know that there's a history of, uh, I think we've talked about it before, but insurance being for, for slaves going across the ship and people that are having yeah. the product. But I don't know if it goes any further than that. I wonder if there's, there's probably some deals people had with money and, and trinkets to, to change. I was, I was listening to a thing. <laughs> this made me think there was a, a little video that was like, I consume a bunch, uh, generally. But they're they're saying like I consume a bunch of information all day, but I couldn't tell you like what uh, an in depth thing about it because there's so much information. I thought that was funny, but you know, podcast. Um, someone was saying that the idea most people have the idea of older societies like bartering off top, and they're like, oh, and then money wasn't made until like fifteen hundred, sixteen hundred, seventeen hundred or something, and no one had credit or debt. But apparently. Societies did have a lot of credit and debt before there was barter, and so there's a lot of cycles of of that money stuff before. But I wonder if there's any people who had insurance on stuff. Like, yo, if you don't give me back my cow, give me give me a sheep, huh? Who knows what they had? I just don't know about. Probably had so many, like, so many civs, man. So many civilizations. Probably had like DeFi, like <laughs> back in Jesus's time, but nobody wrote it down. Just someone forgot, and they're like, oh, dude. <laughs> they're just so enthralled by the technology. <laughs> they're like, why would we write it down on freaking rocks, you idiots? <laughs> they invented you DeFi this? before they invented paper. <laughs> the, the people that wrote stuff on paper were just the like scum, like brainless people of society. And then, but like some weird magnet storm happened, and all the cool technology was washed away in a magnet storm tunnel. And then we just it's like rocks. Jesus Christ. What we have now. now we just have weird planes and stupid metal computers. Sometimes I'm in the shower and I'm just like, dude, like, people probably used to just smell like shit, like, all the time. Like, I read somewhere once that, like, in medieval times when they were churches, they would smell so fucking bad because no one, like, showered for months. They would, like, bring in a bunch of, like, petals of, like, roses and, like, pump perfume in the chapel. That's what the the churchy incenses were for. Uh, I, I guess probably yeah. half of it. Someone asked, and they were like, "What is that? What's that? What's that smelly stuff for?" And some church official had to say, "Oh, that's you know, it's for God and stuff." But then in the back, when they have their uh, their behind the scenes church snacks, they're like, "Yeah, everybody just stinks." So we had to b- go burn some bossel wood. Everybody's eyes are just burning from the bo. And it always smelled like shit in castles because, like, they were just shit in buckets. Like, you know, never sanitize. And we got cold that. and dark, rats everywhere. Perfect place for, like, a plague to just brew up, you know? Every hundred years. Fuck. 1912, 1812, 2021. Imagine coronavirus back then. I'm sure they would have figured it out eventually. I think it's kind of the same scale probably would have taken like a little bit longer i think the black death like killed a lot more people because they like were technologically so ill adapted to what they needed because you know they didn't have soap so it's like kind of a big thing what did we but do we have in a a covid vaccine or something dude shout out what's the next one what's the next disease It'll happen in like uh, two, one hundred years from now. Two twelve, two one twelve, two one. Yeah, happy was twenty one twelve. That's how they're gonna say it. Nineteen eighty. Are these masks just here to stay for good? Like, is that what's going on, or is it just a? It, I mean, thing? first of all, it's a little. It is a little. You have less things going in the air, so it's kind of innately healthier. Uh, but you know, probably three years give it a, a slow decline. Yeah, it's so annoying. It's like it's like I'm always looking for my mask. Mm. You know? Like, come on, like Well, with Ricker and Bond's mask finder, you can find your mask 
right on your sh uh, pocket. Mask finder. Think of that. I mean, <laughs> that's a it's it's a little bit of a flash in the pan, but you know, you probably have a couple years for people to get into it. 